right, welcome back to the class. Okay, so this is 2 exponent x is equal to x exponent 32. Okay, so we are going to manipulate the equation until we are able to get our final answer. Okay, so we want to eliminate this x here. So let's multiply it by 1 over x. Okay, and then if we, if we do that, we are supposed to do that, but we are supposed to apply the same concept to this exponent here as well. Okay, so we can say 2 exponent x multiplying another exponent being 1 over x is equal to x exponent 32 okay multiplying this multiplying another exponent being 1 over x okay so this exponent being 1 over x here is here because we introduce it here okay so what we do here we do the same thing here all right so this is going to be 2 exponent x multiplying 1 over x is equal to x exponent 32 multiplying 1 over x okay so we are going to have this cancelling this okay so here we're going to have 2 okay is equal to this is 1 okay so it's going to be 2 exponent 1 which is 2 so 2 equal to x exponent 32 over x okay now in solving questions like this you manipulate the equations the equation to a point where you can compare both sides of the equation okay so we know that 2 is the same as 2 exponent 1 okay so here we're going to have 2 exponent 1 multiplying x exponent 32 over x okay now we want to eliminate the 32 here so to do that we multiply here the exponents the entire exponent by 1 over 32 and then we do the same thing here as well okay we multiply this one to by that same 1 over 32. So we are going to have 2 exponent 1 multiplying an exponent being 1 over 32 is equal to x exponent 32 over x. Okay, multiplying the exponent 1 over 32. Okay, so this exponent being 1 over 32 is here because of this exponent. Okay, we introduce the 1 over 2 because you want to eliminate, sorry, we introduce the 1 over 32 because we want to eliminate the 32 do you get me so when we introduce the 1 over 32 here we introduce the same exponents here as well okay so we multiply it by the 1 okay so here this 32 will cancel this 32 so you're going to have 2 exponent 1 multiplying 1 over 3 to is equal to x okay exponent so you can see you're going to have 1 over x here do you get me now at this point we are going to manipulate this part of the equation until we can compare it to the right part of the equation okay so we keep on manipulating the left part of the equation this part until we can compare it to the right part of the equation okay so we, we know that 2 is this 2 this is 2 exponent 1 multiplying 1 over 32 now we know that 1 any number by itself is 1 do you get me so we can write 2, okay, we can write 1 as 2 over 2, okay, so we can say 2 exponent 1, okay, but 1 is the same as 2 over 2, so we can say 2 over 2 multiplying 1 over 32 is equal to x exponent 1 over x, okay, now let's manipulate the exponent here, so we can say 2 exponent 2 multiplying 1 over 2 multiplying 1 over 32 is equal to x exponent 1 over x okay now let's apply a concept of indices here okay so we know that a exponent b multiplying an exponent c is the same as a exponent c multiplying an exponent b okay and this is the same as a exponent b multiplying c or a exponent c multiplying b okay now let's apply this concept here okay so we're going to have 2 exponent 2 okay 2 exponent 2 okay now let's manipulate the, 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 the exponent before applying the concepts okay so this is 2 exponent 2 multiplying 2 exponent 2 okay sorry let me cancel this okay so you're going to have we are manipulating this so you're going to have 2 exponent 2 multiplying 1 times 1 is 1 over 2 times 32 is 64 so this is 64 okay 
is equal to x exponent 1 over x. So let's go further. Okay. Now here, we are going to apply the concept here. Do you get me? So we can rewrite the exponent here in another way. Or we can rewrite this part of the equation in another way. Okay. We can say 2 exponent 2. Okay. So the exponent 2 is multiplying another exponent being 1 over 64. So equal to x exponent 1 over x. Okay, so 2 exponent 2 is going to give us 4. Okay, so you're going to have 4 exponent 1 over 64 is equal to x exponent 1 over x. Okay, can you see that? Okay, now we know that any number multiplied by itself, any number multiplied by 1 is a number itself. Okay, so if you multiply 1 over 64 here by 1, you still get 1 over 64. Okay, so you are still going to, you can see that let's multiply 1 over 64 by 1. Okay, it's equal to x exponent 1 over x. All right, let's continue. Okay, so this is what we have. Okay, now we know that, we know that 1, any number over itself is 1. Okay, now before we even do that, Okay, let's rewrite this exponent in another form. Okay, so we can say 4 exponent 1 by 1 over 64. Okay, so this is multiplication. So we can do it like this. Okay, it's equal to x exponent 1 over x. Okay, now we know any number over itself is 1. Okay, so 1 here can be written as 4 over 4. Or if you have an a over a, this is 1. Okay, so 4 over 4 should also give you 1. Okay, now let's apply this concept here. So we are going to have 4 exponents, 4 over 4, multiplying 1 over 64, is so equal to x exponent 1 over x. Okay, now let's manipulate the equation here. Uh, let's manipulate the exponents here. So we are going to have 4 exponent 4 multiplying 1 over 4 multiplying 1 over 64 is equal to x exponent 1 over x okay so you can see we have manipulated the exponents here okay now this is the same as 4 exponent 4 okay 4 exponent 4 so this 4 is multiplying 1 1 by 1 is 1 now let's multiply 64 by 4 Okay, so we have 2, 5, 6. Okay, so equal to x exponent 1 over x. Do you get me? All right. Now, here we are going to apply a concept of indices. Okay, we have already introduced the concept in the class. Okay, we said if you're having a exponent b multiplying c, this is the same as a exponent c multiplying b. Do you get me? Which is the same as okay a exponent c multiplying b okay which is the same as a exponent b multiplying c do you get me all right let's continue so we apply this concept here so you're going to have 4 exponent 4 okay and then the exponent 4 the exponent 4 is multiplying 1 over 2 5 6 okay it's equal to x exponent 1 over x okay now 4 exponent 4 is 2, 5, 6. So you're going to have 2, 5, 6 exponent 1 over 2, 5, 6 is equal to x exponent 1 over x. Can you see that? Now here we are going to compare both sides of the equation. So you can see this is x exponent 1 over x. Do you get me? The number here is the same as the number here. Do you get me? The number here is the same as the number here. Or here is x, here is x. So it means the unknown number here is the same as the unknown number here. Okay. Now, therefore, we can say that x is equal to 2, 5, 6. Can you see that? All right.